Then we have the elevation profile. This is very important because this is a 3D product. So we will make a path here and don't press OK until you mark two points. One will be the source, one will be the destination. So then you can write some name like my path I'm typing. When you say OK, there is a path from one point to another. Now this can show the elevation profile. Elevation profile, profile please remember that terrain should be on. Show the elevation profile from one point to another. How many ridges are there, undulations are there, or you can say peaks are there can be seen here. So this is a plain land, as I said, you have to open or tick the terrain and then you can see what will be your path if you want to go by road, by walk or whichever way you want. Let me take you to a position where you see more peaks where you can not reach normally. So from here, you can make a path again and this is being draped over the actual terrain or satellite imagery because on the background, it's all 3D mesh, nothing else. So this is the peaks you see and from if you go to every peak, you will see the height in feet and you can change it also so the whole uh, elevation profile and the range can be seen.